Lighters up, Leo. It's your girl, the Stoner Girl Tarot. Back with, no with another reading. If you haven't already, roll up with me. Light up with me. Drop down in the comments. Let me know what you're smoking on. If you don't smoke, no worries. You're still more than welcome, Leo. I pre-shuffle these cards off camera. This is for the Leo Collective and the Cross Watcher. Take what applies. Let the rest fly. Page of Cups in Reverse talks about no messages coming in whatsoever. And maybe that's the reason you're watching this reading, okay? Let's get started. This reading is about the current energy between you and your person or your whatever situation you're dealing with. Spirit team, what's going on with Leo? You're currently in your Queen of Pentacles energy. Okay, you're making boss moves. You're doing good with money, your career. Um, you could be feeling like you're the total package for someone. A Capricorn could be in your energy. Or your person is a Capricorn. It doesn't have to be. This is also Aquarius energy. Now, one way that I'm interpreting this is some of you, especially uh, it's Aquarius season right now. Some of you have started acting new, like you want to get to a new level. So you got to, you know, do something new. And some of you are starting to see the results of you. You could have even like been going to therapy and you're healing parts of yourself that has been getting in the way, Leo. Um, some of you are starting to like really get motivated and grounded and serious about something that you're trying to create. Fitness, diet could be significant for you. You are in this energy of also not accepting things or not doing things that you know you shouldn't be doing right now, like, you know, not eating sugar. Um, you know, not being lazy. Um, you could also just not want any outside temptation or influences right now, which is good. Your money is looking good, Leo, or it will be with the King of Pentacles here. You probably had to or you will have to drop some behavior that isn't really conducive again to who you are trying to become or what you're trying to have this also the seven of cups in reverse talks about someone who is no longer blinded they're no longer procrastinating they know exactly what they need to do okay and all of this energy is beautiful as far as your person leo page of pentacles energy They're taking small baby steps to build something with you, possibly with the King of Swords here. Over time, they see if they make these small efforts or just make these efforts in general, that it could lead to conversation or, you know, um, again, healing energy. You've been on your healing ish. Um, they feel like conversation may solve the issue that you're having what's this king of swords about yeah to work things out with you they feel like okay if i reach out if i'm consistent you know it may be little small steps here and there it's basically somebody your person is trying to come back into your life and so they may reach out to you okay because they want to work things out how do they feel about leo should i take that i don't know you tell me okay they feel like if yeah they feel like if they just wait for you to do it that you're not gonna do it meaning you know as far as like reaching out so they feel like in order to get what they want, their justice in the situation, they need to put some type of 
effort into this. Okay, a Libra could be significant. A Libra, Aquarius, or Gemini. So what happened? Queen of Wands here. Motivated action. Someone who's willing to grow this relationship. Yeah, there could have been... Um, the, the, the reason your person is feeling this way could have something to do with maybe, you know, in the recent past, there was an attempt to end any type of drama or conflict that you have after someone walked away. For some of you, someone walked away because this Queen of Wands, this Leo, Aries, or Sagittarius didn't want to or didn't want to or didn't care about fixing this. And so someone walked away. Clarify this energy. The connection was always at the forefront of both of you's, both of you's, both your minds. Um, somebody done got too big for their britches. That's the, that's one of the ways I can describe this energy. Like somebody felt left out, somebody felt forgotten about. And so someone walked away, but like both of you held the relationship in high regard or the connection in high regard. You know, at least both of you think about this, but someone feels like they had to leave. Why is that? Yeah, someone felt like the other was being indecisive or not really sure about them. Like someone could feel that they're not in the same league as the other and that at some point this person would be left behind or, you know, forgotten about left for someone else. That kind of energy. And maybe it has a lot to do with Leo, the fact that you're you're on a, a, a new glow up, you know, you are trying to reach a new level. And so you've been working on you and maybe this person took offense to that. Or maybe it, it, it made them realize that they were not doing enough. And so now they need to step up because you 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 are advancing. What's going on with y'all currently? More air energy. Wow. More air energy. If they're silent, someone is getting comfortable with the silence. It's kind of like it is what it, wow, it is what it is type energy. Some of you are definitely dealing with an air sign, Gemini, uh, Libra, Aquarius. Someone has accepted the truth and they've accepted the ending to this. Someone could have said something in an argument even and it like really killed them. It killed their confidence that's what I was hearing earlier and so but with that whatever was said there could have been some truth to it and that's why it hurt this person or someone is hurt that may have motivated you Leo to tackle this new mission you have maybe that's the motivation behind your glow up yeah, this is powerful, man. And this could be you, Leo, you know, cutting this person off because you're getting over the pain. You know, the pain is still there. The disappointment was still there. This is a relationship or a situation that was very dear to you. But like this Queen of Swords is coming off to me like, I'll show you. 
I'll show you how bad I am, how bad of a chick I am, how much of a boss I am. I'll show you that's how it's coming across. What else? That page of cups, bottom of the deck in reverse. So like I was saying, some of you are okay with the silence. Some of you are not, but the two of you are probably not talking right now. Someone could also feel like they're owed an apology, but the apology is not coming right now. And for a lot of you, that's okay. You don't need it. You took this as motivation to like glow up on this person. What's this person's next action towards Leo? What's their next action towards Leo? They're planning, making plans to do what though? They may plan to come towards you, but they feel like it won't be successful. I should put that down here, maybe. They feel like it won't be successful. What's this Nine of Cups about? Yeah, they feel like you've already let, left them, them out in the cold. So that's why it won't be successful right now. What's the outcome, spirit team, best case scenario? Someone. With these two cards right here, Leo, I feel that the silence or the fact that someone could possibly get ignored in this situation um, someone's going to get mad or they will try to get someone's attention at all costs. Um, this is also giving me, I want to have the last word in this argument. What else? Yeah. I want to have the last word. This is also Gemini and Virgo energy. I want to have the last word. I want to have the last say. Um, and this could honestly, it also feels like Leo, this person checking you out and them seeing that they lost out on a good person. Like they see your glow up. They see that you're changing. They see that you're transforming and they feel left out. So ultimately, it seems like if this person decides to come around again, which they want to, but they feel like it won't be successful, the same theme of someone feeling like they're going to be left behind is still there. Or this is you, Leo, you know, glowing up on this person and they see it and they know that they they're missing out. What other messages do you have? Yeah, somebody's disappointed. Oh, you done got their attention now. They want to give to you now. They probably want to do to you what they um, should have did before. They see you now. They want to give their time, effort, and energy into you now. They do right now. Um, so, yeah. I just don't feel like they feel that they can just come at you like that right now because they feel like you'll reject them. That's your reading. Thank you so much. Leave me a comment. Let me know what you think. And I'll see you later.